Welcome to How It's Made, Python Edition. First, these pythons get a hot bath to relax them for the journey. After their bath, each python gets a private container. Then, they're wheeled down the hall to the VIP quarantine area. Time to check in. A tap on the console opens the quarantine gates. The sign flashes, isolation, I in progress. Through another secure hallway we go. Another automatic door opens. This place has serious security for its valuable. In the science department, a python gets its physical. After a close examination, every snake gets a tiny number tag. Now, we're heading to the controlled red area. It's a giant airlock where the pythons go through a full decontamination cycle. Doors shut, lights flash. The second set of doors opens to reveal a highly automated area with robots and tech. A robotic arm lifts the python's container placing it gently on a conveyor belt under a supervisor's watchful eye. Time for final check-in. A technician scans the container's barcode. Beep! It's verified and ready for the next procedure. Viewer discretion is advised. The Python is now on a conveyor to the auto skinner. Lasers are locked, system active. Wait, are those fish? No, this scene just shows how clean and automated the entire process is. Totally normal here. And we're back to snakes. This stainless steel separation station delicately removes the skin. The skin goes one way, the rest, the meat, separation is vacuumed complete. away. The prized, patterned skin continues its journey. The machine signals. Separation com Next, the skin gets rolled flat. Workers feed it through a press heated to 42 degrees Celsius for a perfectly uniform fit. All systems are green as the machine runs smoothly. Here comes the perfectly pressed skin, expertly handled on the other side. He's not just catching it, he's inspecting it and making tiny adjustments to ensure absolute perfection. This is an art form. Now for the B side, the skin's underbelly. It's still top quality, sorted by the team into batch A grade I trays. On this line, the A-list skins are sorted. These workers meticulously arrange and stack each piece for high fashion production. Every batch gets a passport. An automated labeler applies a QR code to the tray, which a quality control officer then off to the pre-wash zone. This steam room gets the skin squeaky clean before the next round of beautification. Into the giant washing machine they go, one tray at a time. This is an industrial strength, heavy duty cleaning cycle. Sometimes, a personal touch is needed. Four tough spots, this worker gives the skin a good old-fashioned scrub down. If scrubbing isn't enough, we bring out the big guns. This high-pressure washer blasts away any remaining imperfections. Now, the automated super soaker. Doors open to reveal racks of skins waiting for descending jets of water and steam. Here's the inside view. Sweeping nozzles create a hurricane of water ensuring not a single scale is left unscrubbed. After the wash, it's time for a cool down in the conditioning tunnel, where a giant fan circulates a fine mist. Onward we go. The skins, now patterned side up, are soaking in all that misty goodness. More mist, please. The journey continues, with fans whirring and mist swirling. These skins are prepped for greatness in this controlled environment. Time for another dip. A giant robotic arm lifts a basket of skins out of this bubbling cauldron to drip dry. And back they go for one more soak. The robotic arm dunks them into the bubbling brew for a final treatment. Here's a wider view. The robotic arm churns the skins in a special liquid as part of the tanning process. Now for more cleaning. Inside this machine, giant rotating brushes scrub the skins while getting a constant spray down. Here's the full sequence. They're brushed, sprayed, then squeezed through rollers, leaving them clean and partially dried. Look at the result. Gleaming, clean skins roll out on the other side, ready for their next adventure. A marvel of efficiency. Meanwhile, whole pythons get a deluxe disinfection. Scientists seal the chamber, hit a button, and the disinfection... Here's the view from inside. It's a total whiteout as disinfecting mist fills the chamber. A germ's worst nightmare. The skins get the same VIP treatment. A scientist starts the cycle, and the chamber fills with sanitizing mist. Now we're underwater. 
The skins are on a submerged conveyor for a final rinse, pushed along by water jets. Here comes the big squeeze. A giant roller presses down, wringing out excess water for 65% moisture reduction. Final inspection. Under a magnifying lamp, a scientist scans for imperfections. The tablet gives the all clear. The inspection continues. Every square inch of this valuable material is scrutinized for anything that might compromise the... He goes in for a closer look. The loop reveals the intricate pattern, and every detail is logged. Data-driven fashion. Now for some preservation powder. One worker applies it by hand, while machine does the same on an industrial scale. Look at this line of powder brushers working in harmony. This crucial step cures the hides, ensuring they'll last for decades. And we jump ahead. The skins are now dyed, supple leather. A worker sorts the finished product in a fully stocked warehouse. Another checkpoint for traceable leather. A quick scan verifies the batch and records its life story. Trace Secure System Act double and triple checks. Every container and batch get scanned. The system tracks everything ensuring quality from start. Back at the beginning, another batch of pythons is escorted to the tanning section where raw hide becomes leather. The conveyor pushes deeper into an industrial maze of vats and steam. This is where a secret chemical recipe, time for a tumble. Workers load the industrial sized tanning drum with hides. The heavy door seals and the cycle begins. At the mixology station, a chemist prepares a precise formula. The computer confirms. Chemical load complete. T Elsewhere in the lab, another custom blend is prepared. Each color and chemical plays a specific and potent role in, in the control room. Well done, the numbers sir. are perfect. Temperature and pH are optimal. The screen flashes optimal conditions. Behold, the giant wooden drums. They're for tumbling hides in the chemical brew, which softens and preserves the leather. Uniform mix achieved. The drums have done their job. The material is discharged and the chemicals are now neutralized. After the chemical action, it's back to the water for a rinse cycle, washing away any residual tanning agents. Out of the bath and onto an automated stretching machine, an operator carefully lays the skin down for perfect stretching. The machine gently but firmly stretches the leather. The goal is tension balanced, not too tight and not too loose. Final touches. A robotic arm applies a fine mist, like a conditioner or sealant, while scientists oversee the opera. And done. Oil application complete. The scientists admire the perfectly treated skins with their healthy, luxury. Now for the final touches. As these pristine skins glide down the line, an automated mister gives them a final spritz. It's not just one line. This place is a super highway of skins. Every piece gets the same meticulous automated. Welcome to the conditioning room or the leather library. Here, treated skins hang in a perfectly controlled environment to cure. And perfectly controlled means 27 degrees Celsius and 65% humidity. The board says it all out of the library and back to the floor. This leather is going through rollers to soften and flex the fibers. Look at the gloss. The rollers press and work the fibers, giving it that buttery soft feel that luxury goods are known for. And here's the result. A perfectly smooth, supple sheet of high-grade leather, ready for the cutting room. Next, a trip to the sauna. A worker loads smaller cuts into a massive industrial dryer for a slow, controlled cycle. For bigger pieces, we have this wind tunnel. Giant fans circulate warm air to gently dry the leather without me and from the sauna to the rainforest. In this chamber, a curtain of cool mist rehydrates the leather just enough. Is that crocodile? A quality control inspector goes over this hide with a lighted magnifying glass. He's the final gate. Time for a little waterproofing. This technician is applying a clear protective coat. Watch what happens next. See that? The water beads up and rolls right off. That's a high-performance finish. Your future wallet is now coffee-proof. Back on the main floor, it's time for final sorting. This piece gets scanned and earns its place in the grader bin. Scan, inspect, and stack. It's a perfected rhythm. 
Every single piece is accounted for and sorted by quality. The leather is ready. This cart is loaded up and labeled for its destination. The cutting section, where sheets become puzzle pieces. Off they go, pushing the precious cargo down the factory highways. Next stop, the cutting area where precision is key. In a more automated part of the factory, this robo-cart zips along to the shaping department. No pushing required. It's not just the leather that's high-tech. Here, all the hardware, buckles, zippers, and studs get a robot inspection treatment. In the design studio, a designer lays out pattern pieces on a giant touchscreen. A few taps, and the 3D model is complete. Another masterpiece in the making. She finalizes the design, and the digital file is sent directly to the cutting machines. Here, digital becomes physical. The machine projects a laser grid to scan the skin, ensuring the best parts are used. The multi-tool head moves into position with surgical precision. It has scanned the material and is ready to make the first cut. And there it goes. The blade moves at lightning speed, cutting the pattern pieces with flawless accuracy. Following the digital, over on this machine, a rotary blade makes quick work of a solid brown hide. Different materials require different tools. Once the machines are done, humans take over. These workers are sorting the freshly cut pieces into organized kits. The sorting continues down the line. Every single piece of the garment is accounted for and organized, ready for assembly. Another quality check. Before being sewn, the pieces get one last look over. Only perfect cuts make it into the kit. What about the scraps? Even the leftover bits are processed, run through a machine to be repurposed or recycled. The offcuts are collected in a reused material bin. These scraps will be repurposed. Sustainability is fashionable. Every single cut piece gets its own individual QR code, allowing it to be tracked throughout the entire assembly process. It doesn't matter the size or shape, every piece gets tagged. It's the ultimate in traceability from start to finish. In the lab, pieces undergo more tests. A light table checks for flaws, while calipers measure thickness to the micrometer. And it's a pass. The pieces are approved, and an automated sewing machine kicks into gear, stitching two pieces together. While robots handle straight lines, complex work requires a human touch. This skilled artisan guides the skin through a machine. Look at that focus and precision. These are craftspeople. Here, another artisan is attaching the collar with expert care. A quick snip and a specialized steam iron presses the seam flat, while a colleague attaches the luxurious satin lining. Here's a tricky bit, sewing the zipper. It has to be perfectly straight. He then adds a custom braided leather pull. He's done, and give a satisfied thumbs up. Now a machine creates intricate, decorative stitching. This isn't a seam. It's art. Wow. The machine finishes a perfect little rose, stitched right into the leather. The level of detail is simply breathtaking. Back on the assembly line, a zipper is added and a button is pressed on. Each step brings the garment closer to completion. From jackets to wallets, the process is the same. A machine attaches a snap and every zipper is tested for another perfect seam. A small metal roller immediately comes in to press it flat ensuring the jacket hangs perfectly. Check out this specialty roller foot. It allows the machine to glide smoothly over the textured surface of the snakeskin. Time to make it official. The brand label and size tag are stitched in. Even the care label gets scanned. This isn't just a label. It's a certificate of authenticity with a QR code sewn right into the jacket. A final inspection before it leaves the sewing floor. A technician snips any stray threads and gives the lapels a polish. And now, the jackets take flight on an automated conveyor system, heading to the finishing department. The transfer is confirmed. Look at the scale of this. An endless river of jackets, moving in perfect sync to the finishing department. Another checkpoint, another scan. The factory's all-seeing eye ensures every jacket is where it's supposed to be. Transfer OK. Welcome to finishing. First, a light buffing brings out the skin's luster. Then, a finishing spray is applied. He's making sure every inch of the jacket is buffed to a perfect sheen. The friction creates steam, 
showing a thorough job. Now, for a final steam treatment. This removes any wrinkles from manufacturing and helps the jacket settle into its final shape. But why steam by hand when a robot can do it better? In this booth, a robotic arm applies a super fine, even coating. The robot moves with a grace a human could never match. The screen hits 100% and the curing process begins. Here's a different system, same principle. A whole bank of nozzles moves in to coat the jacket like a car wash. The nozzles sweep across the front and just like that, we're at 100% coverage. Another perfectly finished jacket is ready. The control screen shows a 3D model of the jacket, turning blue in real time as the robot applies the coating. The spraying is complete. Now, a heat press is used on specific seams to ensure they are perfectly flat and bonded. One last trip to the steam room for the batch, and a final human inspection. The tablet says final QC, pass. Welcome to the final frontier, automated packaging and shipping. The jackets enter this endless corridor of finished goods. Ooh, a sparkly one. This inspector gives a glamorous green jacket a quick check before sending it on its way. Time to come down to earth. A worker takes a jacket from the overhead rail and places it on the conveyor below. Every jacket gets a final scan. This tells the factory's brain that this item has completed the entire process. Item reg beep. The system pulls up all the info, and then the magic words appear in green. Hashtag finishing complete. It's so satisfying to watch. Pending and registered. It's like a pizza order tracker, but for luxury jackets. From the factory to the staging area, the jacket is dressed on a mannequin, and final tags are placed in the pocket. And now, the final step. The jacket is carefully folded and placed into a protective garment bag, ready for its journey. And there they go, a pallet of luxury, loaded onto a truck, from a python in a hot tub to a runway in Paris.